Who's behind door number two? The more you let go into my feminine yielding nature, the more universal power floods through you. The feminine. Dislocation, orientation, unity. Who is this archetype of the feminine? The feminine has flair for innovative guidance, the ability to always follow its own true direction in life. She is the way shower for others, whether directly or indirectly. The feminine focuses on the vision and allows resolute purpose to guide it. This archetype knows where she is headed, whatever obstacles she might face. The sense of direction is reliable, both for herself and others seeking guidance from it. The feminine is receptive and adaptable to what life offers and always knows the path to follow. She is devoted and determined in her pursuit of inner direction. This archetype reminds us of the deepest truth that we are all one. She teaches us to care less about what others think of us and more about how we all are a natural part of the whole. The path of the feminine is the path of synchronicity. She knows that all things happen in the exact right timing and there is no way for us to be outside of the stream of life. So she doesn't overthink the flow. She knows how to manage wealth. She is the most yin of all archetypes. This isn't necessarily the energy for making money, but our feminine archetype likes prosperity and the comfort of knowing that there is a secure and consistable supported foundation. In this way, she embodies the vibration of abundance. The feminine takes in the resources created by the Empower Archetype 14 and allocates them in order to facilitate the expression of power and skills. The feminine manages resources in order to have what is needed to make a transformative expression and contribution in the world. It does this so that the wealth is available to create influence and to get things done in a transformative way. While the feminine has an inherent alignment to end understanding for where someone or something needs to go, she can get frustrated or exhausted from trying to do all the work itself. She is not necessarily the one who is here to do the work. Rather, she holds the gift of coordinating where and how the creative process can be directed. The secret for the feminine is to find the right allies in life in order that their combined gifts can flourish. Her key words are Earth, Magnetic, Prime Yin, The Receptive. The internal motivator for this feminine energy is We are all one. Trust in everything. Constant orientation. Her positive attributes are She knows the direction forward embraces everything, yields and flows. Her Achilles heel is melancholy about things that not moving fast enough, seeing the universal rather than the personal, and the inability to cut or push away. Her repressive nature is lost. You are out of alignment with your true universal destiny. You live without regard to the greater environment. Without the experience of a direct connection to the greater cosmic force, you feel lost, disconnected or half-hearted. Life seems to have no purpose. The reactive nature is regimented. You are enforcing an external rhythm or structure over the top of life. Regimentation attempts to organize life into some form of meaningful and logical framework. You try to control life and pin it down. And without the overlay of controls, you are afraid of everything falling apart. There is no space for or freedom of flow. Are you flowing with her? Here are some questions you can consider and ask yourself to deepen your contemplation. When do you feel lost? What does it mean to be in sync with life? What great synchronicity have you experienced? Are you becoming regimented in order to feel in control? Do you say, if only I would have? Are you often setting an agenda? What does unity mean to you? Do you intuitively feel your direction forward? How do you move forward? With fearlessness? Great abandon? With trepidation? Caution? 
only after careful research and planning, serendipitously, are you able to surrender to your destiny, divine timing, and the last one. What do you need in order to create a solid foundation for the fulfillment of your dreams? And to strengthen the feminine, you can use this following mantra. I am trust. I am embrace. I receive and yield. I am my own North Star.